Hello everyone, Mustafa's Movie Corner here. Today I'm gonna do a VHS DVD update for August 11th, 2020. Today I'm gonna be showing you three VHS tapes and five DVDs that I recently got. Yesterday, I received those two DVDs from Amazon.ca and on Saturday, which that being last week ago, I actually did went to out of town, which I did went to downtown and I went there to Valley Village, which it was actually the same one I went back in April 2018 and it somehow ran into a choke fest because as y'all can see um I only picked up three features tapes and three DVDs from that Vi Village place. Um they didn't have any of those more features tapes um much restocked. They didn't have any more um but only but I only found those three I needed so I went ahead and strained to it anyway but at least if it's better than nothing, and especially when I'm very lucky to keep those three which are rare, which we'll get into that in a bit. But like for right now anyways, um, for about for any further ado, um, here we go. Um, first up, I'm going to begin with those first six items which I got from Valley Village when I was in out of town in Saturday of last week. Here we go. First up, the um, 1998 features of Little Man. I don't know what year this movie's from. Um, I've looked it up on IMDb, but I... S oh wait, actually, yeah, now I remembered. This film's from 1998. Yes, I remembered. I thought I, thought I somehow forgot, but no, it turns out I remembered correctly. So yes, I was a, I was able to say what year this movie's from. And like right now anyways, this has Muriel Hemingway and Chris Sarandon. For all those who loved Little Woman comes Lucia May Alcott's Little Man. And you can probably already tell this is a screener copy and it says this too. For trade use only, not for sale, rental, rental or public exhibition. And I also forgot to mention on my contact features tape, which that being last month's update, but oh well. Finally a movie. Hold on. Maybe I should just... Or maybe I might as well leave it like this instead. What the heck? Like right now anyways. Finally a movie I can honestly recommend it to everyone. Little Man is a heartwarming story with a great message. Says Bruce Barker Children's Broadcasting Carbonation. For everyone who loved Little Woman. Little Man is just the ticket says Bill Hoffman New York Post. Think big, expeditional family entertainment that has action, adventure, and rising young stars based on Lucia May Alcott's celebrated sequel to Little Woman, big support, and millions of impressions in <sighs> Nashville advertising camp camp again. <sighs> Sorry I screwed a little, I just can't even pronounce it right. Like, anyways, Trailer Dawn, Dennis the Menace, There Goes the Neighborhood, Adam's Family Reunion, The Mighty Kong, and the other family entertainment films in the Warner Brothers 75th Anniversary Celebration. Big celebration as part of the 75th Anniversary Celebration. Every video of Little Men will come with more than 150 worth in savings. Big hit, 
huge awareness from national April 24th to digital release paves the way for video success. This Warner Brothers movie was co-produced by Allegorio Films and Brainstorm Media. This movie was rated PG and the running time is 98 minutes. And get this, um, not only that this tape is rare because of the screener copy, look at the tape. Yeah, this the sticker label copy, um, the white one with black text. Yeah, I was not expecting to come across of this. So, I went ahead and merged it. And this kind of looks like to be recycled tape, although the key says 98 minutes, but this actually um, turns out to be a recycled tape because of the bigger amount of film strip. Hmm. Kind of interesting. And the tape, as you can see, um, needs to be rewinded. The print date is April 13th, 1998. Yep. Next tape. This was originally from 1990 from MGM. The Great Lie from Betty Davis and George Burnett. As you could probably already tell, this is a reprint copy from Warner Home Video. A baby for Betty and a Oscar for many a star. Oh, if I haven't really said so, um, this movie was from 1941 and it was renewed in 1968. And I don't feel like reading this part right here. Um, just don't feel like making this video too long. Um, y'all might as well have to pause and read if y'all may want. Yep, this movie's in black and white. Not rated. The running time is 1 hour and 41 minutes, aka 101 minutes. Here's the tape. The print date is December 20th, 2001. I'm. I'm. And later of this point, I'm going to have to check this tape to see if it might have the Warner Home Video logo or either the MGM logo. I have not popped in this tape yet. Here's the last tape and here's another screener copy cassette copy of this tape. The um, 2000 feet chest of next Friday from Ice Cube. I believe this is a 2000 movie, if I'm not mistaken. Hot soundtrack featuring songs by N.W.A. With Self Gene, Ice Cube, Ale yeah, Big Timers featuring Lil, Lil Wayne and Mac 10, Lil Zane and more. The suburbs make the hood look good. A delight as funny as there's something about Mary, says Mick Lissane, San Francisco to Chronicle. For promotional use only, not for sale or rental. Yep. I got another New Line tape from my collection, and this was actually my very first New Line screener cassette tape. Very happy with this. Number one movie in first two weeks of release. Hmm. This only says the same thing as in the what front says, so I'm not gonna bother reading this part again, but I might as well read this. Ice Cube heats up the roll, says Free Kings the player the players club. 45 day PPV. Friday, 176%, higher, learning, 
Hold on a second. I got a distraction, so I'm gonna stop the video and I will be right back. So give me a second. Okay, everybody, I'm back. Sorry for that stop right here. Um, probably because I got some a little bit of cleaning to do, so that's why there has been a little bit of distraction, as y'all heard in this update video right now. But like right now, anyways, um, let's continue on. Um, higher learning 172 percent. The players' cup club. 159% and Anaconda 148% um, says source video store magazine John Witherspoon says the Wayne's Brothers house party Tommy Tiny Lister Jr. says the fifth element TV internet and radio champ Idian <sighs> I can't pronounce this right either. <sighs> Order the pop hotline 888-907-9090. Street date June 6, 2000. Um, hold on, wait. Hmm, I believe the running time for this movie is 100 and no, 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 no. I believe the running time for this movie is 98 minutes. Oh, what am I doing? Um, sorry for the screw up. Like I said, I believe this movie was 98 minutes, but... And of course, this tape is rated R, but... On the actual tape, um... It says 1 hour and 44 minutes, which... Also known as... 104 minutes, which I'm not so sure what that's about. Um, probably since because of the screener copy. Um, oh well, but like right now, anyways. Um, here's the tape. The print date is March 24th, 2000. Um, this tape actually does have a shrink wrap on. The case of the tape when I um got it, but it I I even already took the rest of it out since it's already opened. Yeah, there was actually there was originally a shrink wrap on the box, but like I said, I already been open it open it up camera. So yeah. Already then now like that's gonna do it for those three of those VHS tapes and now um on to those um five DVDs this first one this is the 2002 DVD of Fight Club 2000 1999 movie almost I screwed this up but like anyways it has Brad Pitt Edward Norton a David Fincher film Mischief Mayhem Soap The digital THX Mastered For superior sound and picture quality Yeah, I, yeah I'm thinking of doing Yeah, I'm actually thinking of how I wanted to see this movie So I went ahead and bought it I'm do plan to give this a watch sometime Mind Blowing says Philippia Weekly Bold Bruising Humor says Peter Travels Rolling Stone Savagely Funny says Chigaiko Tribune Hmm I don't feel like reading the bonus features It'll take too long And I and I might as well didn't need bother reading this part either Hmm yeah Hmm Let me see what this movie is rated Hmm, let me look at the disc. Hmm. Hmm. I don't see the rating, so I'm probably guessing that I forgot to look the rating for this movie on IMDP. Hmm. Yeah, I do not I do not know why, but whatever. The running time is 139 minutes, and here is the disc.
Yep, this was intact. There was also another copy, but I just decided to go for this one instead since it stayed intact. Next DVD. The 2004 DVD of Men, Men on Fire. Let's see. Hmm, let me see what year it is. Hmm. Let's see. I believe this movie is from either 2001 or 2004. I could be wrong though. Please let me know down in the comments. An action-packed adventure says Greg Russell WBTV Detroit. Wide screen. Magnificent keeps you on the edge throughout says WGN TV Chicago. Two time Academy Award winner Denzel Washington guides a masterpiece of mayhem in this powerful says Los Angeles Times. Action trailer hard drinking burned out CIA op operative John. Quasi says Washington has given up on life until his friend Ray Byrne says Oscar winner Christopher Walken gives him a job as bodyguard to nine year old Peter Ramos says Dakota Fanning bit by bit Quasi begins to recover his soul but when Peter is kidnapped Quasi Fiery Rage is released and he will stop at nothing to save her. Includes audio commentaries by director Tony Scott, co-star, director, fanic producer Lucas Foster and screenwriter Brian Hillgland. Rated R for language and strong violence and running time is 146 minutes. And here's the disc. Yep, this was also intact. And it came with this DVD guide. Here are the scenes. And this booklet. Hmm. Sorry, just taking something out out of this booklet. Hmm. I'm not gonna go in detail on what I have. Just don't feel like doing it. Okay, let me get this again. Alrighty then, now the last three DVDs I'm gonna show you all. The last three that, that were all brand new. Yep, those three DVDs were brand new. This next DVD is the 2005 DVD of Absorbing Favorites. Nine underwater favorites. Yep. Another SpongeBob SquarePants DVD for my collection. And as you could probably already tell, this is the Canadian release. Yep. The episodes are Ripped Pants, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy, Karate Choppers, Gary Tixie Bath, Jellyfish Hunter, The Fry Cook Games. Club Spongebob, Plankton's Army, and The Lost Episode. The special features are Bikini Bottom Personality Quiz Game and Ripped Pants Kiroroki. Um, for that Ripped Pants Kiroroki, um, it was actually my favorite Ripped Pants music video of all time, which I actually like this Ripped Pants song from this Ripped Pants episode.
my favorite. Not rated U.S. ranging in Canada, and the running time is 114 minutes. Um, the running time for my VHS copy was 55 minutes, but probably because of those four episodes, or make that five because of the double length episode, which was the sponge you could fly. Um, the running time for this was mainly 114 minutes. So yeah. Here is the disc. As I said before, um, this DVD was um brand new. Yep. Alrighty then. Now um, the last two DVDs that I'm gonna show um, the last two DVDs are actually the ones I received it on yesterday from Amazon.ca. Um, I ordered these two on Saturday, which that being last week, which was the same day I went to Vi Village when I was in out of town, which I picked up um these stuff, and it actually came in yesterday. First is the com and it, and if I haven't really said so, the last two DVDs are actually the Fresh Prince DVDs, and now um this next one is the complete fifth season. Um, although I haven't really finishing. Well, although I, well, although um I was not finishing watching um the Forbes season, but I I just decided to get this along with the um sixth season in order for me to complete my collection. Um, this DVD is from 2010, and this season aired from 1994 until 1995. Yep. Here comes the groom, Will's getting married. Hmm, this DVD has no special features, but that's alright. Not rated, the running time is 575 minutes, so a longer content, but that's alright. Here is disc 1, and hold on. Disc 2. And. Disc 3. These ha this is how I do not like those discs being stacked. Yeah. But like, anyways, um, it did keep this... DVD guide and here are the episodes in disc 1 disc 2 and disc 3 yep as soon as if I'm done watching the um the complete Forbes season, um, I might as well have to go ahead and give this one a watch sometime right before watching this. Um, this last DVD in this update, um, this DVD is from 2011 and that is the complete 6 season. This season aired from 1995 until 1996. Yep. Since I now got that DVD along with the, um, fifth season I do now have every single the complete collection of the Fresh Prince season on DVD which I now have six of them finally yep I finally have six of those at long last um, the first season on DVD um, the one I bought from Valley Village in New Market which was back in January of this year, which the one I bought, um, it was used, but those four DVDs were intact good. So, yeah. But, like, right now, anyways, um, it's a wrap, the final season. This DVD has also no special features, but that's alright. 
also not rated and the running time is 542 minutes so a long good content but that's all right here's disc one disc two and disc three yep and just like the complete fifth season, it does came with this DVD guide. The same one, just like the fifth season. Probably because it contains free discs, so that's why it's the same one, just like the fifth season. Yep. Um, the seasons 2 until 6, um, are the ones I originally get from Amazon.ca, which was brand new, but, as I said before, um, the first season on DVD, um, this is the only one I bought from Value Village in New Market, which was back in January of this year, um, the one I bought was used, but, like I said, the 4 DVDs stayed intact good. And now, as I said before, I now have every single Fresh Prince, all of the complete seasons on DVD at last. Well, although I have already said it as, well, like in a minute ago, but I have just decided to say that again, that part where have I already said it, but I just had to say it again. But like right now anyways, um, that's going to do it for my... VHS DVD update done for August 11th, 2020, and I hope you all did enjoy this video, and I will see you all in the next upload. This is Mustafa's Movie Corner, signing out.